Now the heading one, heading two, and perhaps heading three styles are some of the most common styles that people use within their Microsoft Word documents. And there's a few reasons why. One, they're default, they're built into the system, they're quick and easy to use. Number two, there's many features within Word that rely on those styles and actually benefit from those styles. Here's one of them. Now that we've formatted our document using heading one and heading two styles, and I keep going with heading three, heading four, heading five, heading one and two and three are the most common, but you got some other ones as well. Now that it's formatted that way, Microsoft Word automatically creates an outline for this document based on those headers. And this is all done through the navigation pane, something else we looked at earlier when we were talking about find and replace. On my keyboard, I'm gonna press Control F, Control F. This will open up my navigation pane. You can also go up to your home tab. On the far right, you can go to find. It'll be the same option, Control F or home find. Now, inside the navigation pane that opened up, I've got headings, pages, and results. Now, results we were looking at earlier when we were talking about finding. Here, I wanna look at headings. If you look closely underneath headings, these right here, the ones I just drew the arrows next to, those are all your main headers. Heading one style. The ones underneath there that are slightly indented, those are using, what do you think? Heading two styles. Now this is an outline view and I could use it to navigate as part of the navigation pane. This is kind of like a little built-in table of contents. I can click on power of videos and it would take me right there, power of videos. I can go to one more header and it would jump me to that portion of the document. A nice interactive outline, all built for you based on using the heading one and heading two styles within your Microsoft Word document. Thank you, Microsoft. All done for you. All you had to do was format it. So try this out. If you haven't done it already, get the styles in there. Remember using heading one, heading two at least. You can use heading threes and fours, get more subheaders underneath there, but at least the heading one and heading two, and then open up your navigation pane, control F or home find, and now you've got a super slick, interactive outline view of your document based on those headings. Try it out.